Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well and staying safe and healthy at home. Today, I'm going to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of online learning. I have more disadvantages than advantages, so let's start with the advantages. The advantages of online learning are the students can learn safely at home without being exposed to a deadly virus which is affecting the world right now and has reached almost 12,000 cases in Malaysia up to today. The students can also spend more time with family and parents who travel often and don't get to see them, and they can form a closer bond with them during this time. Lastly, the students can also learn more on how to use the computer, laptop, iPads or phone. Now, I'm going to state the disadvantages of online learning. First, students can easily lose concentration. They off their cameras and do other things such as use their phone, watch YouTube or TikTok. And they don't pay attention to what the teacher is saying. They also just mark their work as done and tell the teacher done. But most of the time, they don't actually do it. They can also spoil their eyes because of too long screen time. At home, the teachers can't guide them properly as well. And most of the time, students do not do revision and waste time on other things, such as playing board games with family, watching TV, and watching movies. That is all from me. Thank you for listening. Please stay safe at home and don't go out unless it is really necessary. And take Good care of your health. Please use ma- your masks and hand sanitizers. I hope to see everyone in school and say our final goodbyes to our friends and lovely teachers before we all go to different schools next year. See y'all and stay safe. Goodbye.